it's me, your old friend Dale Howard. Today I want to show you a very simple trick how you can display summary tasks in the resource usage view in Microsoft Project. Now keep this in mind everybody. In every task view you automatically get to see the complete work breakdown structure of summary tasks and subtasks. So in this schedule for example we have summary tasks representing phases. They're at the first level of indent. We have summary tasks representing deliverable sections. They're at the second level of indent. We also have at the third level of indent detailed tasks. So if I scroll through the project a bit, you can see I have a complete work breakdown structure in this project. However, when I go to the built-in resource usage view, I come away a bit disappointed. I can sure see the name of every resource, like Benji Montanez. I can see all the tasks that each resource is assigned to, but I don't see the summary tasks. So I have a hard time telling where in the project these tasks are actually located. But there's an amazing little trick using a built-in group that you can use to display summary tasks in the resource usage view. So in the middle of the view ribbon, there's a data section with a group by pick list. On the group by pick list, there is a group most people don't realize is there. It's called Assignments Keeping Outline Structure. It's been there for many years. We've just never noticed it probably because you can only use it in the resource usage view. You cannot use it anywhere else. So if I choose Assignments Keeping Outline Structure, ladies and gentlemen, look at this. For each task assigned to Benji, for example, I can see the complete work breakdown structure, the pre-renovation phase, the design deliverable, renovation phase, construction deliverable, telecommunication, sub-deliverable, and so forth. And as a bo bonus, I also see the outline number of each summary task as well. So folks, that's it. It's a little trick, but I think it'll give you great benefit in your own projects. Thanks, everybody.